Alright, so we're checking out the only game where you get to sell cars overpriced so much that it causes everyone into bankruptcy and to fall into a life of crime, drugs, and alcohol addiction. It's Car Dealer. We're ruining kids' college funds, damn it! I appreciate that I get to decide on the gallery name for my auto dealership, even though realistically all it's going to do is cause unending emotional trauma to people. Is this one of those games that gives you limitless amounts of spaces to name your car dealership? We eat your meat, and by meat, I mean money. Without money, you will fall into debt. With debt comes hatred, and with hatred comes unwanted pregnancies. I will now write you all a poem. Roses are red, Lambos are blue. If you walk into the Yeet store, your entire life is screwed. Alright, let's ruin some goddamn lives. Wow, this is the game, huh? I appreciate that incredible free font that we get for day one. Ah, excellent. I've begun my lifestyle as a car salesman, as all car salesmen do. Alcoholism. This doesn't look like a house. It looks like someone's storage unit where I just happened to throw my bed. Is there a bathroom here? Whatever, car salesmen don't need bathrooms. Ah. Uh. Oh, so this, this is, this is what we're doing here in this game, huh? Ah, flipped Unity Asset Girl. Good to see you. Oh no. <laughs> My car store name just went right through the ground. <laughs> All right, everyone. Welcome to whatever I named this store. So the first thing's first. We have to see if we can screw people over when they're buying the cars. Where am I allowed to put this thing? There's like no rhyme or reason on where you can put this. Boom. Lambos. We need to make enough money to get- What the hell is this? It's supposed to be a million dollars, but the game is missing a zero. Oh my god. Can I get the million dollar vehicle for $100,000 eventually? Oh, you can get a Uranus. The name of this car dealer is... Onichan. <laughs> Hold on, I wanna- Oh, you can set the price too. Okay, the recommended for this is... 13200 but, um... I have a plan. Now this is the type of car dealership that we're eventually going to go to. The kind where they freaking Star Trek beam the car onto the platform. We're open for business. What is Donkey Den? It's a place where you can buy bodyguards. What are these traits? This guy's name is Lorik and he's a cat lover. Is this guy's name Soda? I like that his only defining quality is wow. <laughs> Tomato? Shit, someone already bought my car. Wait, come back. I haven't screwed you over yet. All right, let's try this again. How you doing there, Uranus? Do you want to get sold? No, Gray, please. So you can set the prices in real time. We have to wait until a sucker comes in to buy this car. And then we're going to catfish the shit out of him. All right, car. Now you got to look this guy right in the eyes. Right like that there. Perfect. Okay, get this set up. Okay, wait for it. Wait for it. Now! Yes! Yeah. <laughs> Can I buy that? Can I buy this screwed up Lamborghini now? <laughs> Not enough money, you lying bastard! It's missing a zero! Should be sold as priced! After a long day of screwing one single person over, I'm so tired that I need to go to sleep so we can continue tomorrow and buy every single car in the game. Can you people not do your domestic violence right out in front of my apartment? This lady's like, it's not even an apartment, Gray. You live inside of a giant dishwasher box. Yeah, I know, don't rub it in, bit. Look at how many people are in front of the shop today. Everyone was like, wow, I heard someone got screwed over here. I wanna get screwed that hard too. All right, we need I need all the platforms for this. Ah, the Onichan Sport. Lure him in with the 57,000. All right, everyone, we got two new cars in stock. Who wants to get their entire life savings drained in one single purchase? All right, ready, Onichan? You gotta go like this. Dab on haters. Dab on haters. So, how many numbers are you allowed to put in here? Oh, no. Clearly, I was shooting too low. Okay, we've got a customer. She kind of looks like she skins teenagers, but it's fine. Which one you going for, ma'am? This one? It's a good choice. Damn it. You gotta do it at just the right time. That's a very flaccid tie you're wearing, sir. Don't just look at them. Buy them. Yeet. Ah, it's a brand new day getting out of bed. Day three. We, uh, we made a couple of car sales yesterday. <laughs> you know, I think it's time to find out absolutely everything this game has to offer. Look at this pleb car I've got sitting over here. Hold on, let me get rid of this. Yeah, sell it at half price. I don't even care anymore. I want all of the Lambos. The best part is, is now we can just automate 
the screwing process. Where's uh, Phineas Catlord or whatever his name was? I want to buy all the different things you can possibly get now. Yeah, Loric, uh, you're... Oh, you're fully purchased. I'm not just renting you. I've bought you as a human. I appreciate that every single bodyguard goes to the same hairstylist and the same tailor. Soda, Captain Tomato. Yep, you're part of the team. Sebastian River. Why are you the only guy with a normal name? Whatever. What is this achievement bodyguards? It's just a cut and paste picture of the bodyguard. So how come they got a unity guy for the bodyguard, but not for the freelancer? I can make a website for you. Thus more customers come to the shop. I worked as five years webmaster, four years Photoshop, eight years karate, 15, what? Yeah, whatever, you're all, you're all hired. What is this? It's a mascot, but it's so depressed looking. It attracts the attention of customers and entertains them. God, this panda looks even sorrier. It looks like he's been crying for the last 10 years. Here, I'll give you a job, Mr. Panda. You won't be able to afford any of my cars, but at least you can pedal yourself out in front of my shop. Oh, Jesus Christ. I didn't think I would actually get a panda. All right, hold on. I got, we got work to do. First off, we have to open up the store here. What in the name of God? <laughs> <laughs> no, my, my one bodyguard is like sitting Indian style in front of the store. Have some professionalism, sir. Stand up. This guy's coming in here to buy a car and he's like, what have I gotten myself into? What is the name of this store? Is he doing leg exercises? He's doing such a kid. What is this game? I mean, I, I really don't need to screw the prices. The prices are pretty bad enough as they are. Hey. I think we can buy more upgrades and stuff. Hold on, there's other things here. What is this shop? Roll up security? Yeah, give me that. Uh, security camera. How are you gonna steal a Lambo? Alarm system. Toughened glass? What are they gonna try and shoot their way into the store? All the transport. Thief. Chance to steal more expensive vehicles. What is it? As in I'm hiring a guy to steal from my competitors and give the cars to me? That's amazing. Yes, Mr. Thief, you get all the levels. This is, this is the guy who had eight years or whatever of karate experience and one best freelance web designer one year in a row. Welcome everyone to best cars. This looks like it was made in 1993. <laughs> Welcome to the best auto gallery in the world. All the vehicles and models you are looking for are here. All vehicle models from 1850 to 2023 are available in our gallery. This website is made by Adam. Adam. I got my money's worth. All right, I've worked for the last 20 minutes. I gotta go to sleep for a while, hold on. All right, guys, the, the gallery's closed. Are you guys just gonna... What are you doing? The shop is closed. The shop is freaking closed. No one gives this Are you gonna stop them? The shop is closed. What am I paying you people for? Actually, can I lock everyone inside? So the customers can teleport through my security windows. But the security guards and the panda never go home. So, um, I think I may have broken the game because um, I can't go to sleep. The, uh, the time of day never changes. Actually, if I never need sleep, this is perfect. Congratulations, Loric and Captain Tomato. We're open 24 hours a day now. All right, yeah, I want, uh, I want the motorcycle side over here. What else we got that I can buy? Yep, that, we're gonna have that. I don't even know where this goes. We'll buy this too. It's true. I have unlimited stamina now. The day never changes. Can I sell motorcycles here? What, how does this even work? I can sell Mack trucks? It doesn't even fit on the car pedestal. So can I, hold on, can I get another one that's like partly inside of the gigantic truck? All right, yeah, auto buy this. Hey, stop sniffing this other truck's ass. There when two trucks love each other very much. Um, I, I think I may have broken this guy. Yeah, whatever, let's, uh, sure, that one. Hold on, I want the most popular Onichan, this one here. We gotta have at least a couple of those. Hello, sir, you look like you could use an Onichan. What is going on over here? I'm slowly encapturing the entire city. Come on, I have to be able to squeeze one extra car in here. Oh, oh, I almost, I almost got it. Oh, oh, right there. Got this top floor up here. So, um, I mean, I, I might as well just sell all the Lambos, I guess. Everyone in this entire city is gonna have a Lambo and a credit score of like negative 30. All right, now the top floor is stocked and is making it so people can't actually go home to see their families. Hey, 
Lorik, how are those abs coming? He's like, oh, six pack all day. Can I buy the other bear too? I want both bears. Now people are getting double, double assaulted, double penetrated with bears. There we go. They get them from both sides. What the hell is this over here? Any, what is this like the scratch and dent place? This red one? Was it a junkyard? That right there looks like house on a lot of meth. Hello, junk man. I have a little damaged car. Would you like to see it? Yes, but my cursor doesn't appear on the screen. So I can't actually click the checkbox. So, um, <laughs> I got it. What does this mean? Can I fix these? My freaking cursor left again. Son of a bitch. All right, hold on. I need more space for the other vehicles. God, this is like the Walmart of Lamborghinis. I got to find out exactly what's over in the motorcycle area. I'm not sure I want to go back over to Heroin House because I feel like he was looking at my skin and considering how tasty it was. How y'all doing? None of you can leave, huh? That's good. We're not going to need bus stops in this neighborhood because pretty soon everybody's going to own a Lamborghini. Good old knockoff Spamborghinis. What the hell is this? What am I looking at? Is that a shirt or is that your body? These tattoos are gnarly. You know you're a hardcore gamer when you've got the Dragon Age symbol tattooed on your chest. Say hello to the bike leader. What do we do, bike leader? If you want to sell motorcycles, you have to get a motorcycle sales license. This is the guy that's gonna sell me the license. He's like, you need to buy this licensure and also you need to have at least one felony on your record. You can now sell motorcycles. Still doing them flutter kicks. It's good to see that while I was gone, my people prison is slowly growing. So we have some such fantastic motorcycle models as family, new, crazy. Okay, there's random ATV in here. Every time someone buys something, it resets the goddamn menus. It's driving me crazy. Well, I guess we did it. We broke the game so hopelessly that it won't work anymore for the most part. The days never change. I never have to go to sleep and I've made more money than God by screwing everyone over. Half of the people in the city can't even go home. Well, folks. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Car Dealer. Until the next time, say Foxy much love.